Hi guys, in this episode I'd like to uh, run through a real quick way to kind of set up a 3 to 1 or often what we refer to as a Z-Rig. Okay, um, This is something where if I ask you to set this up, we're usually going to be using this for an uphaul system. Um, I'm usually going to kind of specify a specific anchor that I want you to go to and set up a 3 to 1 and bring it to me um, at whatever point that we're working. Okay, um, This is something that I would want you to be able to deploy quickly um, and I'm going to show you kind of a real fast way to do that. Uh, first off, you're going to want to go to whatever anchor uh, that we've talked about or that I've specified, um, whether that be a tree or whatever that is, and go ahead and create an anchor and attachment point to that. Uh, I've got that demonstrated here uh, with a three to one kind of tied to uh, this bucket, which will represent our anchor. Um, and once you get there, the items you're going to need, uh, you're going to need two carabiners. Um, you're going to um, need at least two pulleys, and you're going to want uh, one length of rope as well as um, prussic cords of two different lengths, okay? Um, within our kits, we generally have these marked with different colors. Um, in this kit's case, they're marked in yellow and blue. Um, and that way you'll have two different lengths there uh, to set this up, okay? Once you've established your anchor, however you want to establish that, whether that be a uh, wrap three, pull two, um, or any other kind of tying system as far as like a tensionless hitch or something like that, um, to your anchor point, then you're going to actually want to set up the three to one system. Um, generally speaking, we have our ropes pre-staged with a figure eight um, safety. You'll want to double check, make sure that that's correct. In this case, it is. Okay. Um, and then you can set this up pretty small. I've always found this to be useful to set up small. What you want to do is set this up with your figure eight kind of facing away from your anchor point. Okay. And set up a Z configuration. Uh, basically something just about like this, okay, um, which will help you set up your three to one. Um, you can use any number of different types of pulleys that we carry uh, to set these up. Um, so long as they're a general use rating on the pulley itself, you want to make sure that these are set up for rescue loads, not personal loads, okay? Uh, so there's a variety of different pulleys here that you could utilize. Um, we do prefer that you tend to stick with some of these smaller ones and avoid ones like the big knot passing pulley because that'll probably be needed elsewhere on the scene. Uh, so stick with these smaller pulleys um, for setting up your three to ones, okay? Once you've got this, this arrangement kind of set up, what you'll want to do is go ahead and put your pulleys in these two points here and here, okay? What we're looking to do is set up a three to one mechanical advantage, okay? Once that's set, go ahead and anchor this pulley to your anchor, okay? So we'll go ahead and hook that in with a carabiner. Make sure we lock that off appropriately, okay? So in this case, we've got it set up to our wrap three pull two. And then on this side, you're gonna take your other carabiner and you're gonna hook it through your pulley, but you're also gonna hook it through your figure eight, okay? The other thing you're gonna to wanna to hook in here are your two prussic loops, okay? You can go ahead and undo these, since they'll come probably coiled like this in the kit, you can go ahead and flake these out, okay? And you'll note that these are two different length prussics. That'll come into play a little bit later in the system when this ties in, okay? And you can just go ahead and at this point, hook these in right here also in the same carabiner, like so, okay? Once you've got this established and you've locked off all your carabiners and made sure everything is safe, at this point, you've set it up small as a three to one, and now you can go ahead and stretch it to whatever position it's needed, okay? You'll wanna keep in mind what's going on with your rope bag at that time, um, and once it's stretched out like this, this here will become your haul line for your haul team, and then this here will become the point at which um, your other rope is attached off of these Prusix cords and actually hauled up the system, okay? So if you're asked to set up a three to one, this is what I expect of you. This is what I expect you to go set up, is set a good anchor, establish this system, and then go ahead and bring it to whatever point that our team has established itself um, for that uphaul. Okay? So that would be the three to one or the Z rig.